Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot. And I'm here to do your daily vibes for Monday, August 13th. This is what I'm picking up on today. This is, uh, I'm just going to do this over, all right? I just did one and I, you know, I just felt like it wasn't right. I It was just too, too um, something for me. So I just felt like I, I really needed to do this one over. So that's what I'm going to do. We're going to see what comes up with this do over because I just feel the need. Now we know that my readings tend to, you know, focus on love. So, okay. Pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. And that's exactly what I just did. <laughs> I'm definitely paying attention to the red flags. It's, it's something is, is up. I'm not sure what it is. <laughs> okay. Very soon, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. And this makes complete sense. Clearly decide what you want. What do you want? You have to be honest with yourself. Are you? I mean, that's a red flag. If you are questioning something, that's a red flag. You know? If something is nudging you and you're not listening, that's a red flag. If your intuition is telling you to do something, I mean, you have to really, really think about something. That's what today is about. What do you want? Clearly decide what you want. Time is running out, and I don't know where that's coming from, but time is definitely running out. I'm not sure what that means. So we have the hangman twice, okay, so it's just, this one's labeled the hangman, this one's labeled awakening. Somebody is going through an awakening right now after they've been wearing a mask and they've been lying for quite some time. They may be needing to go back for what they left. Maybe they're headed towards wish fulfillment and victory and success. Maybe they have to leave something else behind. Stop sacrificing. Stop wasting time. Somebody is carrying a very heavy burden. A lot of responsibility on their back. Going back and forth. Very, very wishy-washy. And that's why the very soon came out. of Back and forth. Extremes. I want to go back. I don't want to go back. I want this. I don't want this. I want something new. No, I don't. There's a golden opportunity waiting. Solid, something solid, something stable. There's a new beginning here. If someone could decide what they want and really seriously pay attention to those red flags. What are the red flags? The red flags are what is causing imbalance in your life? What is causing these ups and downs? What is weighing so heavily on you? What is, what is plaguing you? What is, what is worrying you the most? That's what needs to be dealt with. The time is right now to put in effort. Right now. Somebody has been procrastinating and being in a state of limbo, being stuck someplace where they don't really want to be. Although they have gone through an enlightening uh, enlightenment now they have to take action and they're procrastinating with taking action. There's an opportunity for success and victory if somebody would take action, but somebody needs to take the act. They need to put in effort. They need to work hard. 
at dropping the past, dropping the burdens, dropping the, the baggage, and taking responsibility. There's been a, there's been, you know, somebody has to, to make a serious change here. It's time to let go of, of the old ways. It's time to let go of the stance, you know, it's time to stop resisting this. I mean, that's what these are. Somebody has been procrastinating and resisting making progress or moving forward. And all you have to do is, is put in more effort and stability and security will come right back. But you have to make that decision to do so. There's an opportunity for wish fulfillment here with abundance, a lot of it. And a lot of security too. If somebody could stop going back and forth and, and stop, you know, trying to escape their own reality. That's what that is. You could, I mean, I believe that there's somebody that, that knows what they want. But doesn't have the confidence to take action. You need to have a new outlook in this situation. There's an opportunity for some a new beginning that is really, really solid and stable and long term. But if you allow yourself to escape the reality of this new beginning being possible, then it won't happen. It's about manifestation. If you want it, you can have it. If you believe it, you can have it. If you put in effort, if you put in the work, it can work. But you have to make a conscious change to allow it. There's been somebody that in this situation that has been, you know, very deceitful. But they're being divinely guided... To go back and make things right. The ego got in the way. The pride. Somebody here is afraid of attachment, afraid of commitment, afraid to get attached, afraid of love, afraid of a relationship. But unhappy where they're at, sacrificing a relationship. But now it's time to do the right thing. Now it's time to be held accountable. It's time to be fair. It's time to act with integrity and make this decision that will bring balance back to your life. Right now, things are unbalanced and chaotic and up and down and all around and just a freaking mess because somebody doesn't want to or hasn't been able to do the right thing.
There's an opportunity for someone to be honest here. This is honesty. But it's up, it's up to them. You have to make the decision to do that. This is a decision needs to be made, a final decision. Do you want this relationship or not? The time is now to put in effort, to drop the burdens. Queen of Pentacles reversed. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have Libra here. We have we have uh, Pisces here. These are both Pisces. We have Sagittarius. Doesn't matter who we have. I'm just saying who we have. This is a lack of of discipline. A lack of. Stability. With the Queen of Coins reversed. Somebody may be burying themselves in their job, their work, their, their home, their everything but love to escape the reality. Anybody can take on these energies. Somebody is trying to escape the reality of what their heart really wants. And mask it with everything but love. Because there, there's no love here. Even though there is. It's hidden. There's hidden love. Page of Swords reverse. You know who this is. And you know, you know who you want. And, and it goes both ways. There's some, some observation going on. There's some petty behavior. Somebody is acting very, very immature by not communicating, not taking action. But the time is now. Somebody is really thinking about going back. They're thinking about going back to what they love. That they've walked away from and they're thinking about going back to a relationship, a family. But there's been so much deception, they're scared. They're scared. Pride is definitely an issue here. Let's look at the sevens. Okay. So. It's time to make a decision. And stop living in an illusion. Stop pretending. There's a lot of. Uh, there's a complex decision that needs to be made. In regards to. Wish fulfillment. What is going to make you happy? What do you want? Clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now. Somebody is so scared of attachment that they're giving up something that is solid, stable, and secure. And long term... And it's time to be held accountable. It's time to be able to do the right thing. And head in the direction that is going to make you happy. To do the noble thing, the right thing. And once you do this, your life will get back on track. There's been a, a end of a relationship that somebody is considering going back. That's what this is. <laughs> but like I said, there's been some betrayal, there's been some deception, there's been some some promis promiscuous connections in the middle. And now somebody is very indecisive about where their love lies. 
somebody doesn't know what to do. There's a decision that needs to be made and there's a lot of back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. My heart wants this, but my pride says no. And that's exactly what this is. At the bottom of the deck, we have the four of coins. Somebody needs to stop resisting this change. That's what this is. Let go. Let go of the grudge. Let go of, of the stance. Allow it. I mean, there's so much indecision in these cards, and it's a it's perfect that this one came out. Somebody is truly on that roller coaster of I want it, I don't. I want it, I don't. That's a red flag. Follow your heart. Ask yourself this question. What do I want? What is most important to me? It's time to come out. It's time to come out with the hermit reversed. Come out of this break. Okay? Do you want to grow old alone? Do you want to play games forever? Do you, or do you want something solid? It's time to speak up. It's time to, clo to close the door and open a new one. It's time to come down off of that mountain. And decide what the hell you want. And say it. Express. And think positive. I feel as though there is a new opportunity being presented to you in which you have to make a very serious decision. Do you want it or not? It could lead to a solid commitment. Hierophant. We have Virgo, we have Taurus. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Commitment, faith, believe, follow, follow your inner guide. Believe in what you hear when you ask yourself this question. What do you want? The very first thing that pops into your head is your answer. Go get it. Unless you want to lose it. Talk to you later.